Mike Bowers. I'm Director of Photography for the Global Mail and I'm talking pitch this morning with cartoonist for the Sydney Morning Herald and the Sun Herald, Cathy Wilcox. Welcome to the program, Cathy. Morning, Mike. There just seems to be endless leadership speculation uh, in Canberra. The speculation as to uh, whether staff were writing uh, acceptance speeches or not and uh, it all gets a bit silly, doesn't it? <laughs> if the staff are doing that for you and you don't have to tell them to, that's a good kind of staff. Yeah, They're yeah. anticipating your every need or, in this case, your every ambition. Um, and Mr Zanetti's done I cannot tell a lie, it was my staff, and I think the word from on high going, again. Again, <laughs> that's right. That's, you know, that, that's been used government after government, and, and uh, that's part of your job, is to keep your boss from knowing, in fact, what's going on. I think it's time-honoured <laughs> script from Yes Minister. Yeah, plausible deniability, mm. I think they call mm, it. Don't um, tell me. Lovely uh, uh, Mark Knight, June 2010, Julia Gillard had no knowledge of her staff making contingency plans regarding the demise of then-PM Kevin Rudd. <laughs> I do love this. Morning, guy. What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> <laughs> she walked fast with a coffee. And yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> it is almost like she's fighting two opposition leaders. There's, there's the official opposition leader in Tony Abbott and then there's, there's Kevin Rudd. And um, he himself has probably been working on his speech and Mr Gadelka has picked up on this. Mm. Um, his, Theresa's coming out saying, how long have you been preparing that comeback victory speech now, Kevin? One year, seven months, 23 days, but for God's sake, don't tell four corners. Yes. <laughs> and notice that, that Kevin likes to do the work himself. He yeah. doesn't, you know, yeah. delegate that to a no, couple no. of underlings in his office. I think, no, no. you know, that's, well, you that's often been the complaint about would, him, hasn't it? You wouldn't it? get the polish and poise or, uh, or the, you know, the, the, yeah. the intellectual and you, rigor. And, and you can't work the word zip into it, you know, if you're, <laughs> if you're a staff member with, with linguistic scruples. That's right. <laughs> Cathy, the camera phone in Canberra tell me that uh, Kevin Rudd has suddenly become much more camera aware and uh, I don't think they're suggesting he's playing the, uh, up for the cameras but he's certainly aware of where they are when he's doing this and he's he they believe he's actually making these sort of photo opportunities this was during a division for the uh, private health insurance bill and uh, and just perfectly lo happened that he was having a joke at the front as, as Combe and Gillard were waiting for the division and very serious mm. well I for one Mike never want to miss an opportunity to, you know, in case they might ha be rolling at the time, you know. Are you going to work pussy bow in here somewhere? <laughs> <laughs> well, Kevin does look like the cat that's got the cream, doesn't he? <laughs> he does. <laughs> Um, Kathy, the anniversary of the uh, of the apology uh, rolled around, and, and never one to miss an opportunity. This Ray Strange from the Australian photo, um, Kevin was in the thick of it with them. Just imagine if you just turned the sound off, you'd be thinking that the country was run by somebody else. And yeah. that there was Kevin's doing a terrific job as yep. Prime, Minister. Prime Minister. It's, it's all yep. a very different visual picture. Yeah, isn't yeah, it, it is. Mm. Kathy, uh, this Andrew Mears picture. Uh, Kevin being handed a message stick, what do you think the message contained? Hopefully not from Julia Gillard, anyway. <laughs> or, or her staff, who <laughs> wasn't prepared beforehand. <laughs> Cathy, it's always a great pleasure having you on. Thank you very much for taking the time. Thank you, Mike. I think we covered everything in no depth whatsoever. No, so well, as, look, as shallow usual. is my middle name. Yeah, OK, so... <laughs> you can do the honours. Back to you, Barry.